Hi scholars, Mrs. Sola here with a lesson on third person singular present tense verbs. Whoa, let's break that down. Third person means he, she, or it. Singular is one. So we're talking about what one person or one thing does. Present means it's happening right now or it happens often. Verb is an action word. You already knew that. So today we're talking about things that he, she, or it does. Um, let's see. When we're talking about present tense, we always add either a s, z, or is at the end of a verb, such as walks, plays, or how about pushes? If I was talking about my dog Wally, can you see him? He's back there taking a little nap. I could say, every day Wally sleeps. It's true, he does. Every day Wally sleeps. Or I could say, every day Wally digs in the yard. It's true, doesn't make me happy, but every day he digs a little hole in the yard. Or I could say, every day Wally watches for his friend to walk by. Every day he watches. I have a book to read to you, and it's just full of third person, singular, present tense verbs. Here we go. It's called Money, Money, Honey, Bunny. Money, Money, Honey, Bunny. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Mother. Thank you, Sister. Thank you, Brother. They all give her money. Honey, Honey, Funny Bunny has lots and lots of money. Some of it is big and some of it is small. Does she need to save it all? Off she hops. You say it. Say she hops. Off she hops to the shops. She buys a ball. She buys a bat. She buys herself a pretty hat. She buys. Honey Bunny also spends on her many, many friends. She spends. She buys a wig for the pig. She buys a goat, a, sorry. She buys a coat for the goat. She buys a pen for the hen. She buys a pear for the mare. A mare is a girl horse. She buys a pear. She buys a chair for the bear. You say it. She buys a chair. And a trunk for the skunk. And oh, what luck for the duck. She spends a buck and gets a truck. She buys some jam for the lamb and a blouse for the mouse. For the fly, she buys some pie. For the fox, she buys some socks. You try it. Say, she buys socks. And for the ones she loves so much, all the bunnies in the hutch. That's her family. She buys some clay for brother PJ and some honey for sister Sunny. She buys some candy for little Andy. She buys candy. And for her father and mother, she buys some tops that match each other. A top is another word for a shirt. Honey Bunny gave and gave, but still has money left to save. That book was called Money, Money, Honey Bunny. It talked about all the things that Honey Bunny 
did for her friends. She buys and buys and buys. She spends. I hope you had fun practicing your third person singular present tense verbs. Could you do me a favor? Can you think of something that one of your family members or your animals does every day, such as every day my mom helps me with my homework? Every day my dad cooks dinner. You think of something and make up your own sentence. See you later, scholars. Bye.